Gemini, this is Nick. I came to bring you guys some energy, you guys. I hope that you guys are navigating through this energy pretty well, okay? With this Mercury retrograde coming up, these planets being retrograde. Look, this is some serious heavy-hitting energy, you guys. Be on the lookout for August 30th for the full moon in Pisces, you guys. Um, Mercury going retrograde, you guys know what that means for you, okay? So just slow down every single thing that you do, okay? Um, my rule of thumb uh, for Mercury retrograde is to just have patience. Give extra patience patience for every single thing people places and things so if it's something that you got to do make sure you double check everything make sure you sign no contracts make sure you get into no commitments okay three of pentacles is, is heavy here in your energy gemini there is some moving shaking going on there is some level up going on there is some love problems that's also going on okay so this energy will have an effect on all of this, okay? After the 23rd, 23rd, and after the 23rd, up to September 14th, no signing contracts, okay? For you guys that are on the come up um, and have decided to leave somebody here behind, um, listen, there's nothing but winning here for you guys, okay? But take from the 23rd, to the 14th, September 14th, to think about the proposals, to think about who you're connecting with, who you want on your team. Think about these things, but don't sign any contracts, don't make any commitments, but of course, accept, you know, proposals and those type of things when it comes down to work, okay? Um, be on the lookout for your keys, your wallet, you guys. Um, uh, pay close attention to that, okay? You may have car problems for some of you guys. These things are not going to last, all right? This is just Mercury Retrograde acting a damn fool, okay? So, um, Gemini, you guys are very aware of what Mercury retrograde does to you. Mercury is Gemini's ruling planet. It is also Virgo's ruling planet, okay? So, just like I said, my rule of thumb is to just take things slow. Be patient when talking to people, when receiving information, um, when doing text messages, um, you know, um, like I said, um, even when you're going somewhere, okay, drive slower, all right, leave before time, arrive early to where you need to do, expect the unexpected, expect problems to come up, okay, not like serious problems, but problems that definitely can be fixed, okay, but you just don't want to, you know, be moving too fast in this energy, okay, you guys, I love you guys dearly, all right, so listen, somebody has definitely built a boundary, somebody is definitely standing up for themselves, somebody is definitely, um, you know, basically, um, I want to say defensive to a certain degree, okay? They're standing their ground, all right? They're 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 really in their energy, and they're like, I'm not going to be pushed, okay? These boundaries are for somebody to be to respect, okay? Um, listen, somebody was in a two of swords, okay? I don't know if this is you. I don't know if it's them, okay? Or somebody who you're dealing with a cross watcher. Cross watcher energy can and will get involved in this. Cross watcher, I want you guys to know that I love cross watcher just like I love Gemini, you guys. You guys are more than welcome to stay and watch the video. You guys are always welcome to stay, okay? If this is a Gemini um, and it's vice versa, go ahead in the comment section. You guys are always welcome, okay? Um, I'm very hands on with people, so don't be shy to be in the comments, all right? I love hearing from you guys, you guys. So, cross watcher. Okay, somebody is very confused. Okay, somebody's emotional, they're confused, and they got a difficult decision to make regarding this ex situation or soon to be ex situation. Okay, somebody has already began to build boundaries here. All right, listen, somebody's mind is on their money, and their money is on their mind because this is come up time. This is level up time. You got six of wands and the star. Okay, this right here is victory. The same thing came out last time, you guys. Last time, okay. This is victory, success, accolades, fame, praise, awards, recognition, winning, being in the spotlight, you guys. Things are about to turn around for you guys, okay? You got the star here, okay? That is happiness, wishes, serenity, success, harmony, achievements, good luck, hope, commitment, all right? So listen, whoever is in this three of pinnacles situation who is building a team, who has a team, um networking collaboration all of that type of stuff listen somebody definitely is on the right track with that okay and congratulations by the way you guys i love to see that the same energy is in the energy from the last time that i read it for you guys because this is awesome for, for you know you, you gemini's are going to be experiencing this okay um so yeah this is great and what i also realized too in this here read is that somebody um because i remember the last read 
it was um, haters, okay? That was like, you needed to be on the lookout. Some of you Geminis dealt with that. Y'all handled that. I can see that, okay? You got King of Swords, Sirius in your energy. You got three of, three of Swords twice here. Somebody has called that thing a thing, okay? Where somebody did not want to call that thing a thing because somebody was either dealing with rel karmic relatives, somebody was either dealing with a karmic individual, somebody who was very close to them and they did not want to call it a thing because they knew that they was hating, but they knew that what would come after if you said, okay, this is a hater. Because we can't have haters in our vicinity. If we label them a hater, that means that we got to make a move to do something about that hater so back in that other video it was about making the decision to call the shot well in this here video it, this is for gemini's that has called the shot and i'm proud of y'all y'all this is what i'm because you guys about to go far okay um yeah king of swords is in this energy some of y'all gemini's have got ruthless okay some of y'all gentlemen like you know what nobody but nobody is going to stop my success nobody but nobody is going to stop me from going forward okay including the person who i lay next to okay um i'm tired of having a blind eye the only thing that i'm interested in is this three of pentacles i need to build my team i need my solids around me so that i can have this here victory this success this fame this accolades okay travel is still here travel may be um you know something um that is going to be coming up okay listen this is a person this cosmic coven i mean this this is somebody who it is like a twin flame soulmate connection you guys this is somebody who is in somebody's energy big time that somebody trusted that you know they have to cut out okay they literally have to cut this person out or is cutting this person out okay doesn't necessarily have to be because they broke i mean excuse me because they had a third party situation even though this is a three of swords but it could just be because they broke somebody's heart okay it could be because of the disappointment it could be because of the letdown all right it could this could have been one of the haters all right separation grief heartbreak exit betrayal heartache disillusion upheaval sadness trauma sorrow depression okay one word all words no words okay this is the reason why this person is getting cut the fuck off okay so over here we got queen of pentacles now you may embark it you may be embodying queen of pentacles energy uh, gemini um or this is somebody who may be one of these team members okay um somebody definitely does want to talk or this could be your somebody who you're thinking about walking away from virgo taurus capricorn is a queen what queen of pentacles is but if it's not a virgo taurus capricorn it's just somebody who gets to the money okay somebody who brings the bag home somebody that takes care of the home somebody that take care of the kids um they believe in stability and comforts of the home okay and they go out there and get it and they bring it back okay that's all that is and that in the shadow side this is a very materialistic individual okay who doesn't necessarily take care of home they spend their money on things other than bills okay like shopping okay or trips or whatever the case may be okay we don't know what's going on with this individual right now okay we just you know this is just to cause us out regarding this because you got um three of swords twice okay um listen when i break this down we got we, we right back we right back to the relocation we right back to the traveling we right back to the going in a piece of four waters we're right back networking you know um at a distance you see what i'm saying somebody may be networking online collaborating with this here three of pentacles um broke down the six of swords uh, this three to the three the six of swords this could be somebody who somebody is collaborating online with meeting connects online okay starting a business online this could be any of that type of stuff okay baby mama baby mama at a distance somebody that you're dealing with that you know maybe um is at a distance but definitely relocation definitely definitely travel okay Somebody wants to talk, y'all. Okay, Eight of Wands is here. Now, either this person wants to talk that somebody's about to turn their back on or somebody is about who had them in a third-party situation or somebody who just broke somebody's heart, okay? Um, or um, somebody wants to talk about this relocation and travel in this collaboration, okay? One or the other, okay? But Eight of, Eight of Wands is here. Somebody definitely does want to talk. Listen, I really truly believe love you, that I love you too. You I, okay. I really truly believe that the person who wants to talk, okay, um, is the person in the relationship that somebody decided to walk away from, okay? Or somebody will be decided to walk away from with this heartbreak, third party situation, this grief and sorrow and exit and heartbreak and separation, all of that. Okay, yeah, I think they want to talk. But see the thing about it though, Gemini, is that this is not gonna do anything but lead to intimidation change winning at all costs conflict deception defeat pride before the fall surrender coward hostility this is a fight 
This is not being on the same page with somebody, okay? This is a fight. And the energy that I have here that I'm feeling within myself is you're not going to stop me achieve, okay? Your bullshit is not going to stop me achieve. I'm not trying to give you no more of my energy. This is whatever toxic person that somebody is coming up with all these three of swords, okay? This ex individual here with this six of cups, okay? Um, I'm not willing to be confused and bothered by you anymore. I'm not willing to be on guard anymore because I got shit to do, okay? And what my what I have to do is my level up, okay? What I got to do is my victory, my success. That's what I got to do, okay? My fame, my praise, my accolades, my awards, my recognition, my winning, and my being in the spotlight. That's what I have to do. And I'm not willing to give this shit no more of my energy. That's what it feels like to me, okay? So, you guys, I have already prayed over these cards, okay? In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, okay? So, we're going to get right into the read. But before we do, Gemini, I want to uh, thank my day one. You guys, thank you so much. I love you guys. Thank you for riding with me. Um, I love seeing you guys down there in the comments. I got some that has been here for so long. You guys are, are so solid, you guys. And the support that you guys have given me in this channel is immense. And I am humbled by it. I love you guys dearly. Thank you so much, okay? Uh, for the ones that are new and recent to the channel, you guys, you guys, first of all, excuse my light is coming down on me. So it's like it's, you know, I'm trying my best for it not to be in my face. But um, thank you so much for accepting my invitation to the channel, you guys. I'm very happy that you guys are here. And um, if you guys have not let me know that you're new to the channel, please go down there in the comment section. Let me know that you're new to the channel so that I can give you a warm welcome myself, okay? For the ones that have not subscribed, please accept my invitation to the channel. There are so many things that are going on, you guys, okay? Um, you can go in the description box and look at everything that I have. My 100, every 100 uh, subscribers, somebody will get a free read. I will find you. Um, my mystery grabs, which are really, really fun, okay? and my monthly giveaways which consists of items and it also consists of reads there's a lot of way to get free reads here on this channel okay um in the description box all of that stuff is updated my prices are there my email is there okay for my verified subscribers all of this stuff is for my verified subscribers my monthlies my giveaways all of that stuff and, and then on top of that all of my prices in there will be discounted. Contact me, okay? And let me just let you know, September 1st, you guys, I am putting a uh, freeze on my personal readings, okay? So as of September 1st, the only thing that I will be doing is my VIP plans, emergency reads, and also the comments, okay? The, um, the, uh, the, the, tarot by comments okay on the channel okay so also be on the lookout because youtube just let me know that i'm now eligible for membership so i will be doing that i'm going to find out some research by the time i do gemini's video again you guys will know about it okay i'm looking forward for you guys to be members i'm going to be going, going live for my members you guys you guys will be able to ask me questions live and all of that type of stuff that's what i've been waiting on because people are like nick when you gonna go live when i get my memberships because they're special okay so yeah with that being said you guys um, overall energy is seven of cups, okay? Listen, I have somebody here, you, cross watch or somebody, okay, who is searching for a purpose, okay? Somebody is overwhelmed. Somebody has a lot of wishful thinking, indecision, sensory overload, daydreaming, too many options, illusions, multiple possibilities, and choices, okay? So that is a very prevalent energy. That is one that came out, okay? So with that being said, let me go ahead and... um. Give me the seven of wands. Your sons and your daughters. Thank you. Yeah, see, this is an ex situation, Gemini's, or it will be, okay? Somebody built a wall towards this person who had three of swords twice, okay? Somebody's very untrustworthy about here, and somebody knows it, okay? And this is an ex situation. You got that twice, okay? Six and six, 12, three. Listen, somebody is not, somebody parties. Um, you socializes, um, you know, maybe threesomes, third party situations. Somebody's getting tired. Somebody's definitely has some type of addictions here. Okay. It could be alcohol addictions. It could be drug addictions. It could be sex addictions. Okay. But whatever the case may be, somebody is, you know, really not on that page anymore. You see what I'm saying? It's like they want to level up. Give me the two of swords. They got a difficult decision to make. True that. Okay. But they're calling the shot. Okay. Like I said, it's an overwhelming feeling of, I can't do you no more. I got to do me. You see what I'm saying? That's what it feels like. Give me six of cups. Six of 
somebody who somebody was married to, somebody who somebody seen somebody's future in their eyes with. Uh, okay, thank you. Listen, this is completion. This is achievement. Hold, some, lack of, listen, somebody may be tripping off lack of closure, Gemini, okay? Cross watcher, all right? Um, but definitely something may be, you know, karma may be here as well, all right? But this is somebody who somebody was married to or had a higher connection with. You know, somebody wants to bring you a romantic proposal or you want to bring them a romantic proposal, one or the other. Right, but see, no, somebody's right back in the two of swords. They're like, you know what, I'm no, I'm tired of the confusion. I'm tired of being emotional. Every time you come around, I go fucking crazy. Like, my mind goes crazy and shit. I can't do this, okay? Like, that's what it feels like. Give me six of wands. Somebody's, somebody wants, somebody's thinking about winning. They want to up their stuff, okay? Right. And see, let me tell you something. What's coming up in between this is this headache that this person that's in this lover situation is bringing, okay? Like, I got to stay focused on what I got to do because you're a headache, okay, to me, all right? This love is a headache to me. It's getting to the point to where it's becoming a headache. Give me lovers. Somebody is concentrating on their opportunities when it comes down to money, okay? Somebody may be a little bit younger than somebody else here. Somebody is very optimistic. They're spontaneous. Um, they're, they're, they're risking it all, okay? So when it get, comes down to this opportunity, any opportunity that comes, give me a star. Somebody has to go, okay, listen, somebody's left on red here. Somebody wants healing. Okay, so the same individual who's been doing the celebration party and get together, third party threesomes, gossip and messiness, that they want um they want to get off from being red on red, okay? They don't want to be a hangman. They want healing in this situation. Give me the three of uh, uh, coins. For your sons and your daughters. For your glory. Somebody's cutting somebody out of their circle. King of Swords twice. Might be cutting a Virgo towards Capricorn out. Because it's Queen of Pentacles is still here, okay? Tell me what King of Swords is doing, please. It says Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. What is, what is King of Swords doing? Somebody's being cold. Somebody's being in and out. Somebody doesn't want a relationship, okay? They want to they wanna be in and out. They want to be for self, okay? They don't want to be... They don't want to be locked down, okay? And the other individual wants to talk, okay? So whoever it is that doesn't want to be locked down, they want to be for self, they're in and out, okay? They're becoming very rebellious, all right? Listen, this person does not want the commitment, okay? You got another person who does want the commitment, okay? And they're trying to talk. Somebody might be blowing somebody's phone up here. This is Eight of Wands, okay? But King of Swords is in this energy, okay? King of Swords is like, no, uh-uh. Yeah, and it got, I believe, you know, it's... It, Somebody may be older than somebody here. Give me, um, what is he doing? Could have been a marriage, you guys. Somebody's side of this. Somebody wants to come back. Okay, this person, this Virgo towards Capricorn, possibly Sagittarius, Aquarius, Gemini, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Somebody wants to come back, y'all, okay? They want healing in this, okay? Give me this, this twin flame soulmate situation here. Somebody's going to be lying, tricking, and, and manipulating, all right? Give me this three of swords. Somebody already been lying, tricking, and manipulating. Separation has happened, okay? Heartbreak. Betrayal, sadness, trauma, depression, sorrow. I don't know which one is you, you guys. And puzzle pieces, remember that. Whenever you guys get a general read from me, it's always puzzle pieces. Somebody was juggled, okay? Mixed messages was given. Wishy-washiness, okay? Somebody got juggled here. Give me Queen of Pentacles again. Somebody may be pregnant here. Somebody may have just had a baby. Family member or friend may have had a baby here. Right. 
Ten of Pentacles to the Ace of Wands. Somebody wants some new beginning. Somebody wants sex with you or you want sex with them. Somebody wants their family, okay? Like I said, this could be for some of you guys, you guys were married, okay? And for some of you, um, this could be a family member, all right? And then and it's like somebody wants to take action to do something, what? Maybe a family member is saying sorry. A family member might be like wanting to take action to correct things. But it's something that they're hiding, okay? So either way. So either if this is your uh, person or a family member, okay? It's something they're hiding, okay? What is this moon? There we go with your travel. Possibilities, completion. What somebody doesn't see is that this shit is over. There's a cycle that's ending and one that's beginning. Give me the eight of wands. Somebody has graduated. Somebody who has went, decided to go to the next level, okay? They're, they're walking in the directions of their dreams coming true, okay? So this is what they're talking about, okay? Is their dreams. Walking in the directions of their dreams. Relocation, travel, okay? Leveling up. Entrepreneurship, okay? Making more money, okay? It's, it's like this person is in your energy who somebody was in the Three of Swords and was being juggled and is manipulating and carrying on. But I just don't see where this person... Where somebody is choosing to deal with this energy. It's almost like I'm tired of this energy, okay? It's going to be you or a cross watcher. Give me the three of swords in, over here because you guys got three of swords. So I cause somebody to fall back, okay? Seven, um, yeah, because somebody was a liar, a cheater, still a killer thief, you guys. So somebody had to recuperate here, okay? I don't know which one it is that you had to recuperate, but somebody did. You have to retreat. Give me more. Yeah, they had to retreat from the two of um cups. Some of this definitely was a marriage for some people, okay? Higher connection, okay? Um seven, four. Yeah, definitely somebody fell back from this. This is an ending. This is an X. Five of Swords. It's too much conflict. Too much arguing and carrying on. Okay. Look, five of swords and not a swords, okay? So listen, somebody is definitely hasty in this energy. Somebody is constantly, give me more. I feel like somebody some constantly getting on somebody's nerves with all this. It's like somebody's fucking with somebody here, okay? With hostility and bullying and. Whoever the person that's married to or your soulmate, soulmate, twin flame connection or the baby mama, baby daddy, okay? Somebody wants to move fast. In some type of direction. What is this Knight of Swords? Because there's definitely beefing here. There we go. Somebody wants to move fast to make amends. Somebody wants to, because somebody's emotional, okay? Somebody wants, somebody loves here, okay? And somebody is definitely. Wanting to move fast to get this back, okay? I don't know what happened, all right? For some of you, that's the case. For others of you, somebody has met somebody else, okay? And somebody is, like, moving fast towards getting out of a relationship and moving fast towards this person who is on somebody's level as far as love and money, okay? Give me more. And that could be a Cancer Pisces Scorpio. Give me this point of clubs. <clears throat> Somebody looks at this person as crazy, sexy, and cool. It could be a Leo Sagittarius Aries. Something came to an end with. Somebody single. Somebody was messing with somebody, okay? Somebody wanted somebody here. For some of you guys, somebody left a situation to go be with somebody else, okay? But it did not work, all right? 
Um, this person could have been a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, or Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, okay? Maybe this is what caused the confusion um, between this baby mama, baby daddy, okay? Puzzle pieces, y'all. You know what I'm saying? Reverse it, flip it, whatever you got to do. But this is what I have. Let me go ahead and tell you who's on the board. Money looks good, okay? Travel is still here. Um, success is still here, okay? Being spontaneous is what you're going to have to do, all right? But somebody is tired of their ex here, okay? Um... We got Leo Sagittarius Aries. We got Cancer Pisces, Cancer Pisces Scorpio. Whew. Yeah, see, it's too much. It's too much um, arguing. It's too much arguments, disappointments, aggression. Somebody's going to have to compromise here, okay? Listen, with the five and the five, that's ten of swords. This is ultimate betrayal. Somebody betrayed somebody in this situation, okay? Virgo towards Capricorn. Somebody doesn't want this anymore. Somebody wants to settle down. I mean, excuse me, somebody doesn't want to settle down particularly. They don't want it anymore. Pisces. Could be another Gemini, you guys. But this definitely is an X situation. If it's not an X situation, it will be. Somebody's hurt. Somebody's definitely hurt. But there is travel here. Okay, so this is what I have for you guys. If I have uh, put one piece together for you guys, and I have definitely done my job, you guys please like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye, Gemini.